I'm Chris with Magoosh and today I'm going to talk about three ways, three tips on how to ace the GRE. The first tip, doesn't seem like it's that mind blowing, study throughout the week. Don't just cram. And you might be thinking, yeah, duh, but you know what? Most of us, just because, hey, life intrudes, we're going to end up studying on that Saturday afternoon, three hours of GRE. And you know what's going to happen after about a month? Not that much. Why? Because your brain forgets much of what you learned the week before. So don't think you're, you're doing yourself any favors by spending three hours cramming over the weekend. Rather, spend your studying throughout the week. Monday, Tuesday, fine, you can watch TV Wednesday night. Thursday, Friday, more GRE prep, just a little bit. You can do an hour, much better than doing three or four hours once a week or even twice a week over the weekend. Now, another big tip. And this kind of flows from this as well, is the idea of when you are taking time out for GRE, you have your little hour of GRE time. Don't just sit there and start trying to memorize a dictionary or a bunch of vocab words, or even reading passages unless you supplement that verbal prep with some math prep. Why? Well, test A, you are going to go from being in verbal mode to math mode just like that. Every 30 minutes or so, you're going to switch in between them. And you want to be used to doing that. You don't want any surprises test day. You think, oh my God, I have to think of math now. Please, I want to please help me. Instead, when you have your actual study sessions, do the exact same thing and test day, your brain will be ready for it. Finally, speaking of test day, preparing for the actual thing, you know what? Take a practice test at least once every 10 days. That's my little calendar. That's the X. Take the practice test. Why? Well, the GRE is not just about conceptual understanding. It's about performance. How well do you perform? Now, a lot of this feedback comes where? Well, yeah, test day, which is not when you want the feedback because there's no time to adjust. So you actually take a practice test to say, hey, look, I have issues with pacing. What should I do? And only practice tests will tell you that. But by taking multiple practice tests before the actual test, you'll be, of course, able to adjust for these issues. And so that test day, you're ready to rock the GRE, ace the GRE, all positive words the GRE. And you want more GRE? If you're studying for the GRE, then check us out at GRE.com. That magouche.com, and I'll see you there.